All right, here's a question where <clears throat> we're asked to find the angular speed of a wheel in revolutions per hour. Okay, well, I know that my, my formula is this, and I know this is angular speed, but the angular speed th of this one that we get is radians per given time. Uh, so I'm going to have to convert to revolutions in the end. All right, so uh, let's try it. So I need to solve for angular speed. So angular speed is equal to velocity over the radius. Okay, the velocity is this. That's how fast he's going. 39.596 kilometers per hour. And the radius, I'll put that on the bottom. Oh, the this is diameter, so the radius would be 33.5 centimeters. Now, I've got a problem here because I have kilometers on top and centimeters on the bottom. I want to cancel those, but they have to be the same. So why don't we change the kilometers to centimeters? And I can do that by saying uh, one kilometer is the same as 100,000 centimeters. So now the kilometers cancel and the centimeters cancel. So the units that I would have for this number, whatever it comes out to, is radians per hour. Okay? Now, uh, and notice that the radians, they just sort of show up as a unit. If all of these cancel, then the unit I'm left with is radians on the top because I'm looking for angular velocity, radians per hour. Now the question asks you for revolution per hour. So you take whatever this number is, uh, whatever it is, and I have to convert that from radians to revolutions. So I can multiply, this is gonna be radians per hour. So I need to convert radians to revolution. So I know two pi radians are the same as one revolution. So I can cancel those out. Okay, so if I multiply these two and divide by that, That'll give me my angular speed in radians per hour. Then if I take that number and divide it by 2 pi, then my answer is going to be revolutions per hour. Okay, hopefully that helps you with that question.